right, day one. Really excited. Uh, just now we started in uh, Rotterdam and we're driving to Hulsberg, what is in the province of Limburg. Uh, right now my Kilometer meter, <laughs> I don't know what you call it. But, uh, the mileage, but any kilometers of my bike is at 9,437. So 9,437, and I'm really excited to see what it's going to be like. Uh, when we get back, when we're back at this point. So yeah, off to our first stop. <laughs> I don't know why, but I think there's something wrong with the navigation. We're going to find out. And I hope he's going to forest place in the shade. Yes. Yeah, natuurlijk. He's only going for shade for himself. Yeah. So yeah. This is how, how, I'm, how I'm packed. Let's turn it off for a moment. And let's go see what his problem is. So, we arrived in uh, Hulsberg, in Limburg. And right now, we just uh, came from our, from our uh, hotel, we dropped off uh, our stuff. And now we're driving towards uh, a gas station. Because I'm a little bit low on gas. Uh, then we're going to, to drive a short scenic route of around uh, one hour. No, I think it's 114 kilometers long, called the Mergelland route. And I think we're going to uh, to ride it in uh, two hours or so or something. Nice and easy. Better to keep it. Uh, a little bit, uh, a little bit short on the first, uh, the first day. The only reason we uh, chose to uh, stop in Limburg first is uh, to keep our route for the day two uh, shorter. Right now we're driving the Mergelland route. It's uh, quite a fun route. We're not uh, all the hundred. Uh, Kilometers, but this part is really fun. Uh, we have to watch out for uh, the police because the hotel we're staying there, there are uh, at this moment uh, three motorcycles uh, without drivers because the drivers uh, all, all lost their lost their licenses. Well, I think this is a great route to start the vacation with gradually I don't know how to say it but it will get more difficult from here and it's a nice uh, beginner piece of the route it's uh, quite hot today it's more than uh, more than 30 degrees Celsius outside so tomorrow we're uh, we need to drive one hour over the over the uh, over the highway to our first way, way, waypoint. Uh, from our first waypoint, it's going to be uh, five and a half hours drive to our next uh, hotel. So yeah, talking to you is going to be a little bit difficult, I noticed, because every time I'm talking for a minute or two, three. Then the rider in, fr in front of me is talking on the in in the country. And every time it's from, huh? What zeg je? Uh, and what zeg je translates to, huh? What do you say? Because yeah, I'm talking English to, to you, to myself, to uh, everyone who, who wants to hear it, but not to him. So he doesn't un understand what I'm saying. <laughs> Which is pretty funny.
Hij ligt er best wel uh, flink een laag begrint. Ah, oh, fuck. Glijde jongen met die achterkant. Ja, we rijden weer. 